Sherlock is an open source voice ID tool that helps you to find where username is registered across hundreds of websites and social media platforms. This video I will show you how it works step by step. To install Sherlock, you can simply type apt install Sherlock. I already have Sherlock installed. If you are on Ubuntu or Debian based system, alternatively, you can go to the official Sherlock GitHub repository. Copy the repository link, open the terminal, and type git clone and paste the repository link. Once the repository is cloned, you will need to install the required dependencies to run Sherlock. But before that, make sure you have Python 3 installed, since Sherlock is written in Python. In my case, I switched to a virtual environment because the pip command did not work directly on Linux. Next, navigate into Sherlock folder and run pip3 install dot. This command will install all the required dependencies for Sherlock. Now let's look at the basic usage of Sherlock. To run Sherlock, simply type Sherlock username. Here I will use our channel name as an example. Sherlock will scan across many websites and show you where that username exists. As you can see, it found our YouTube channel and other social media links. For instance, here our YouTube channel link it matches perfectly. I will copy it and open it in that browser to confirm. It also found the username on Reddit. This showing how Sherlock helps to hunt username across multiple social networks. Sherlock is also capable of hunting multiple username at once. For instance, I will give two different usernames. To do this, type Sherlock test user123 and the second username I also give as a Sherlock. Sherlock will search for each username one by one. If you want to search on particular social media platform, you can use the site flag. Just type iPhone hyphen, hyphen site followed by the platform name. For instance, I will specify as Instagram. Sherlock will immediately search only on Instagram and as you can see, it found our Instagram page. Finally, if you would like to save your results to a file, simply use the output flag. For instance, just type Sherlock, give the username, iPhone iPhone, output and give the file name. I specify as target.txt. This will save all the results into a file named target.txt for later use. Now it's your turn. Try it out and let me know in the comment. What usernames are you tested? And if you enjoyed this video, please like, share and subscribe to support the channel and join our security journey.